Hi friends, welcome back to Hot Topics in the News. I'm John. David, thanks for joining me today. It's a pleasure. We're talking tech. David, you have a tech that you've been following. It's a big year for tech. It certainly is. Uh, I actually wrote an article in SC Magazine about mm. ChatGPT. That's, That's right. That is a tech that a lot of people have been following as well as the different companies who have given their response to ChatGPT, such as Google's Bard and mm -hmm. a number of other chatbots that are also rising up to be potential competitors or kind of jump on this chatbot wave. Yeah, it's the wave and it kind of began this year at least for the mainstream consumer. Mm -hmm. Now we want to talk about Viva Technology. This is Europe's largest startup tech conference. It's happening in Paris, right? That's right. Paris. I believe June 14th. Yes. It's going to be for a few days. The conference brings together startups. You've got the tech leaders, the you know, the big guys, Google and other big companies, also investors. And that's yeah. one of the key reasons that these festivals are held, right? So people invest money in these startups. What are some of the themes for this year? Well, just like we talked about earlier, we're going to be talking a lot about AI in mm -hmm. Viva this year. That's the yeah. big thing. There's also going to be a lot on climate technology, sports technology, and uh, kind of what's been called femtech, or yeah. technology that centers around uh, women leaders and women's needs. That's right, yeah, technology for women. And then we, we talk about this key English word, underrepresentation. If there are, there, in tech, there are just a lot more guys than girls typically, so women will be showcased. There will be a specific exhibition area. I think like 3,000 women are uh, like an army showing up for this yeah. event. And so. it's interesting because some of the greatest contributors to technology over the years have actually been women. I learned recently that the first ebook was invented by a, a woman from South America. She was a school teacher and she had this automatic reader for her students, so some cool stuff. Now, I really wanna talk about the clean tech though that we're seeing mm, mm. for this conference. Some companies that I'm excited about are the Cumulus machine. Oh. Cumulus is a drinking water company. We were talking about this before the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they basically create drinking water using only solar power yeah. and the humidity in the air. It's crazy. And apparently it's fully autonomous. It's easy to transport and install and it can be controlled remotely. Yeah. So I can just imagine this would be such a wonderful solution for people living in uh, like remote areas in yeah. Africa or Western Australia, places like that. Yeah, getting clean drinking water. There's another company that recovers energy from the grid. Mm -hmm. So basically taking energy that's produced in factories and putting it back to the grid. Mm -hmm. We'll talk a lot more about tech on uh, Advanced this month. Thank you for joining us. This has been Hot Topics. Check out that Viva conference.